Right, we have a preview to do. Sheffield Wednesday versus Southampton. Hopefully I can get through this one without something breaking news. Because that happened with recently. Hello and welcome to this video. Uh, this is the season preview. It is also the season opener for the whole of the EFL. It is Sheffield Wednesday versus Southampton. Can't remember the last time Wednesday had a guy game on these lights. I think it was just quite non non -sequential. I don't think much happened, do you? <laughs> anyway, if you could like, share, and subscribe to the channel, I'd much appreciate it. Liking helps the algorithm, sharing gets in front of people's faces, and subscribing lets me know you like the channel. So, Trevor Wednesday are going against a very good Southampton team, who by the sounds it will have Lavia and James Ward-Prowse still in the starting lineup because they've had bids rejected from uh, Liverpool and West Ham alike. And the thing is, Wednesday's had a really interesting one. Both teams are starting with new managers. Uh, Russell Martin is starting there. We're starting with Cisco. Both teams had a little bit of this whole situation, waiting to see what was going to come in, but started to think, get things flowing. Now, the thing for me, with um, especially with Southampton, is the fact that they are getting really, really close to trying to keep players in. Now, Lavi and Ward Prowse, like I said, are going to start. Uh, and it's, it's going to be interesting to see what Southampton do. They are going to be up there with the likes of teams to go up. It's just going to be the case. This is going to be the thing. It is that kind of thing. They've had an okay window. Keeping Teller, I think, for them has been really good. Uh, Burnley still want him. Uh, but the fact that he knows where the goal is in championship is interesting. Now, let's talk about Sheffield Wednesday. So, Sheffield Wednesday has had such a tremendous start to this uh Start, just start the season. Really high, winning the final at Wembley. Then we get the news that Darren Moore gets sacked. Uh, not sacked, sorry. Walks away, uh, mutual consent due to uh, a difference in wages. Um, then you've got a thing, it took two weeks to get Cisco Munez in. We do get him in. But then he's having to get to work really quickly and doesn't get many players in straight away. It takes a while. The, we get Reece James in. We get Marvin Johnson signed his contract. And then it goes a bit quiet. Then Delgado comes in. Uh, then we have Ashley Fletcher come in. Then we get uh, Paul Valentin come in. Um, today we just signed Musa. Yesterday we signed Diaby. Um, we also got in uh, Bernard as well. And it's that whole thing. We got seven players in. I think I just said six. Uh, we got seven players in and we're looking like we're probably going to have another one in as well in terms of the AC Milan goalkeeper. Um, Vasquez on loan. That's not been announced yet. So it will be interesting to see what happens here because we are starting to make moves in the transfer market now and we're starting to get the players in we want in as well. So let's see where everything goes from here because I think we've got the thing where we are going to be extremely busy still. I still think he wants players in. But it's going to be a good game. I think if Wednesday can play the kind of football Cisco is wanting to play, and that that's the thing, the kind of football you want to play, we saw glimpses of it working versus uh, Luton. But it's going to take a t time. I think we're going to be that time that the team that takes a while to get going this season. Uh, I hope not, but I just have a funny feeling that will be the case. But... Sheffield Wednesday versus Southampton. It's good to finally have football back. We'll be doing uh, a we'll be doing a thing tonight. What I normally do, like the roundup. We will also have a debrief on Saturday. Then we will also have Dead Thirty Watch is doing a watch along on his channel. But there will also be a watch along on this channel for the uh, Carabao Cup game as well. So. 
A lot of good things to come up with. And also, thank you once again to getting me to 3,000 subs. We move on to 4K next. Uh, yeah, it's been, it's been one hell of a journey and it's still going and I'm loving it. So let's keep going. Let's see what happens. But Sheffield Wednesday versus Southampton preview. Come on, let's get three points at S6.